The next thing we're going to do is we're going to try to attach a image to when we create a new product or a new menu item. So we want to upload an image to Firebase or Fire Storage. And then we want to grab that uh, download URL so we can also display this image uh, in our product on each page. So whenever we create a new one, we'll attach an image to the left over here or right away where you want to place it. But that's ultimately the goal for this one now. Uh, if you go to your Firebase in here, go and log into your Firebase, click your Fire, um, your Fire API, and there where you have your database and you have your storage, click the storage one. This is the one we want to do. So we want to store as the user generated files like images, audio, or video, or whatever, right? So click here and get started. And this should prompt you with this one here. So just leave it as it is. Um, Basically, this means you need to uh, have secure items uh, or you need to be locked in before you can actually uh, upload something. So don't worry, just click done and done and change this if you want to have somewhere else for this to go, right? Awesome. So this should start setting up your uh, Google, Google, your Fire Storage instead of the Fire Database. So those are two different things. Data, the database just stores text so, or object in our case, all the things we have with our, uh, our menu items and so on. And in here we have our uh, Google storage. Now we need to set this up and just gonna wait for this in a little bit. So right now this is empty. Uh, and again, default security right uses to be authenticated. So if you wanna switch it up, you can, but for now, um, since we already have a login system, that's great. If you don't have a login system with uh, Firebase authentication, then you need to switch this around here. What I wanna do is I really wanna quickly create a folder. So click create folder and we're gonna name this um, products. Uh, we can name this menu items, but I like products now. Um, and we're gonna add this folder. So this will be our default folder to upload all our images in. So we are not just gonna put them here, we're gonna put them in a folder called products and here we'll put all the images inside. So this is kind of the, the basic startup for this. Uh, and you can also follow the guide if you just go to the Google um, documentations here, get started and just what you need to do to set everything up. Just quickly run through. We already have mo most of this. We need to add our storage bucket uh, here into our fire storage firebase.js over here, which we'll do in the next video. But we're going to set up all the small things and then do small iterations of the next steps uh, toward uploading an image.